You're listening to Soap Dirt, the latest in television entertainment news. Hey there, General Hospital fans. It is Soap Dirt on YouTube, and we have got a special General Hospital edition for you today. These are five General Hospital couples that got married in real life. So they were together on the show, and then they got together in real life. There are five couples, two of whom are still married. To this day, three couples broke up. We're excited to tell you all about this. We did a lot of research. We've got photos. You're going to love it. But if you haven't already, please reach down, click that subscribe button so you don't miss any of our General Hospital spoilers, casting news, and more. All right, this first couple is Wayne Northrup, and you're like, who is Wayne Northrup? And Lynn Herring. Lynn Herring is the name that you should remember because she plays Lucy Coe to this day. So Lucy... Lynn Herring debuted on General Hospital in 1986, but it was her work on the short-lived spinoff Port Charles that had her meet the man of her dreams, and we still count Port Charles as part of the General Hospital universe, just so you understand this conversation. Lynn played Lucy Coe on both the flagship main soap, GH, as well as on Port Charles, and over there, she played Lucy from 1997 to 2003, And also on Port Charles, Wayne Northrup played con artist Rex Stanton. He was on there from 1997 to 1998, a little more than a year. And truly, they had met before they both worked on that series. Um, They married in 1981. 16 years before they both joined the cast of Port Charles, okay? Five years before she joined GH, but a long time before they were cast together on Port Charles, and they had met in an acting class. So their real-life marriage was a resounding success, unlike when their characters got hitched on the GH spinoff, because Wayne Northrup played this guy Rex. Rex was a creep who tormented Scott Baldwin, married Lucy Coe, and then poisoned her, nearly killing her. In real life, things went so much better for Wayne and Lynn. They have two sons, Hank Wayne Northrup, born January 9th, 1991, and Grady Lee Northrup, born July 20th, 1993. After leaving Port Charles, Northrup had a long run on Days of Our Lives as Dr. Alex North. He did more than a thousand episodes from 1981 through 2006. And of course, we still see Lynn Herring often as Lucy Coe on General Hospital. Even now, she's a fixture at the Nurses Ball. She is recurring now instead of being on contract, but we are seeing a whole lot of her lately. And it's super exciting. So the first couple, we're going in order of the dates they married, by the way. But this first couple is still together going strong. This next couple is Jack Wagner and Christina Wagner. Now, Christina Wagner still plays Felicia Scorpio to this day on General Hospital, but she started on the soap back in August 1984. You might remember the Aztec jewel heist plot. That was one of her earlier storylines. Meanwhile, her now ex-husband, Jack Wagner, starred as Frisco Jones, and he also debuted in 1984. But when Christina first came to General Hospital, she was still married to her first husband, but they divorced in 1985, and after that, the on-screen chemistry between Frisco and Felicia turned into a real-life romance for Jack and Christina, and they actually started a family before they walked down the aisle. Their older son, Peter Wagner, was born September 4th, 1990, and then those two got married in December of 1993, and Christina changed her professional name to Christina Wagner. Then on December 1st, 1994, Christina and Jack welcomed their second son, Harrison Wagner, but their marital road was rocky. In fact, they broke up for the better part of a year after their oldest son was born, but before they got married. And then they had filed for divorce in 2001, reconciled and dropped the case only to go back to it a few years later, and their divorce finalized June 30th, 2006. But what's more tragic about Jack and Christina Wagner is that they lost their youngest son to addiction issues last year on June 6th, 2022, when Harrison Wagner OD'd on fentanyl and Xanax. To date, neither Jack nor Christina Christina Wagner remarried, as far as we can tell, and both mentioned the son they lost constantly on social media discussing their love for him and how much they miss Harrison, and they seem to be very agreeable exes. 
Who knew? All right. The next couple is another that broke up. That is Rena Sofer and Wally Kurth. Now, these two are practically daytime royalty at this point, given the shows and long runs they've endured each on more than one soap. Wally Kurth is right now doing double duty as Justin Kyriakis over on Days of Our Lives, as well as Ned Quartermain on General Hospital. Of course, now he's kind of doing triple duty because he thinks he's Eddie Main, his rocker alter ego. So as for Rena Sofer on General Hospital, she played Lois Cirilla. And then she also had a long running role on Bold and the Beautiful. She played Quinn Fuller on there for almost a decade. All right. So Rena and Wally really heated up when they were on GH in the 1990s. Rena played Lois Cirillo, who was Ned's love interest and the mother of his daughter, Brooklyn Quartermain. Lois met Ned in 1993 when Rena Sofer joined the cast, and as their characters fell in love, so did the actors. And then in 1995, Wally Kurth married Rena Sofer. They have one daughter, Rosabelle Kurth, but then Rena Sofer left General Hospital in 1996, and by 1995, 1997, her marriage to Wally Kurth had dried up. Rena told Maurice Baynard on his series State of Mind pretty recently that she and Wally thought they fell in love, but it was their characters that were in love. And she said when their time on when her time on the ABC soap ended, they found they weren't compatible if they weren't playing these characters, which is interesting and kind of insightful of them to figure out. But she also said she really likes her ex-husband Wally Kurth and calls him incredible, just not the guy for her. Rena Sofer's second marriage to TV producer Stanford Bookstaver is still going strong, and they also share a daughter. As for Wally Kurth, he's been married to Deborah Yuhaz, I hope I'm saying that right, for two decades, and they're still going strong, and they share one son. And now, people are talking about Lois Cirillo all over again because of the Ned and Eddie Main weird amnesia twist, and a ton of people would love to see her back on General Hospital. They are our third couple, but one that sadly didn't make it. All right, the next one is a love story that stuck. This is Rebecca Hurst and Michael Sacido. He played Juan Santiago from 1999 to 2001, and that's when he met Rebecca Herbst on the set. Of course, she plays Elizabeth Weber. So his character, Juan Santiago, was the son of Sonny's now-dead wife, Lily Rivera, And he also came back for a couple more episodes back in 2013 and 2014. Meanwhile, Rebecca Herbst has starred on GH as Elizabeth Weber since Liz was a teen. She debuted back on August 1st, 1997, a few years before her future husband landed a role on the ABC soap and stole her heart. So Juan was a musician, and when he popped back up in 2013 to see his cousin Sabrina Santiago, played by Teresa Castillo, they made a cheeky reference to Juan Santiago's wife being named Becky, which of course is Rebecca Herbst's nickname and is Michael Sacito's wife's nickname. So it's kind of cute. Later, Sabrina was killed by the General Hospital Strangler, so there was no reason for Juan Santiago to come back to town. Now, it seems that Michael Sacito is no longer an actor and instead works in marketing. He and Rebecca Herbst married in 2001 and remain married today. One of only two couples that were profiling that met on the set of GH and married and who stayed together. Rebecca and Michael have two sons and a daughter. Ethan Sacito was born October 31st, 2001. Ella Bailey Sacito on April 12th, 2004. And Emerson Truitt on August 9th, 2010. Congratulations to them for sticking with the loves they met on set. All right, our last couple is another one that divorced, but it's exciting, and they were the one who married and divorced most recently. That is Kirsten Storms and Brandon Barish. Kirsten Storms, of course, plays Maxie Jones, and Brandon Barish was playing Johnny Zakara. They met on set, and they were friends for seven years before they started dating, And then in June 2013, they eloped for a Vegas wedding. And five months later, their daughter, Harper Rose Barish, was born. You've seen Harper Rose Barish if you are a longtime General Hospital watcher because she played little Georgie for a while on the soap. And she was darn good in it. And that's because she has got acting in her genes. So three years later, April 2016, they decided to divorce. It was 
amicable. And they said one of the reasons that they are able to still be friends is because they were friends for seven years before they even got into the marriage and the romance part of it. When they split, they blamed irreconcilable differences, and they said there was no cheating, no drama, nothing like that. They remain good friends and solid co-parents. Now, Brandon Barish remarried in December 2022. He and his wife, Isabella DeVoto, are expecting a child together in September of 2023. Maxie Jones was played by Kirsten Storms from May 2005 until now. She's still on the show. Remember, she recently went brunette. And Brandon played Johnny Zakara from 2007 to 13, and then again for a few months from December 2014 to February 2014, 2015. <laughs> and Johnny is supposedly in prison now, but realistically, Brandon Barish is keeping busy over on Days of Our Lives where he plays Stefan Demera. If you haven't, please reach down, click that subscribe button so you don't miss any of our General Hospital spoilers, news, and updates. And just real quick, we're going to run through the couples list again and tell you who's married, who's divorced. Wayne Northrup and Lynn Herring, who played Rex Stanton and Lucy Coe, are still together. Jack Wagner and Christina Wagner, who played Frisco and Felicia, are now divorced. Rena Sofer and Wally Kurth, who played Lois Cirillo and Ned Quartermain slash Eddie Main, are also divorced. Michael Sacido and Rebecca Herbst, who played Juan Santiago and Liz Weber, are still happily married. And Kristen Storms and Brandon Barish, who played Maxie Jones and Johnny Zakara, are no longer married, but are happily divorced and remain friends. Thank you for being a loyal listener. Follow us wherever you get your podcast, because you don't want to miss the next episode. Soap Dirt is on all the major podcast platforms, including Apple Podcasts, Spotify, iHeartRadio, and more.